Let me quickly share with you what I saw today regarding seven cheapest universities in Belgium for international students. It might surprise you to know that some of these universities are accepting tuition fee less than a thousand euros per semester, I mean per year, which is incredibly cheap, you know, looking at the pedigree of the country Belgium. So Belgium is a country bordered by the Netherlands to the north, Germany to the east, Luxembourg to the southeast, France to the southwest, and the North Sea to the northwest. Belgium is one of the countries in the EU, and it is a Schengen country. There are various opportunities in Belgium, and it is one of the best countries in Europe. All right. So before I share this with you, if this is your first time on my channel, I want to welcome you especially. And if you are regular on this channel, I want to welcome you. Thank you so much for spicing my channel. And I want to urge you to please click the like button in order to support this video so that this video can go far. And also, if you haven't subscribed, ensure that you subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button and make sure you click on the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I drop content. You know, I've been to several countries around the world. I have a lot of content already on my channel. And, you know, this is a home for people who want to move abroad to study or to work or for other reasons. Okay. All right. So without wasting your time, let's delve into what you have for today. Okay. So Belgium is a, multi is a multilingual country that offers a quality education at cheap price. So if you plan on taking your bachelor's or master's degree abroad, then make sure to try for any of these cheap universities in Belgium. You know, so this tuition, you know, comparing to some universities in Europe, it is really quite cheap. Okay. Now, what are the general requirements to study in Belgium? Apart from filling out an application form, applicants need to submit requirements such as a high school or bachelor's degree, diploma, transcript of record, passport photocopy, uh, resume or CV, etc. Other documents may, may be needed for courses with strict selection procedures such as medicine, dentistry, uh, veterinary science, physical therapy, speech therapy and engineering okay now do do universities in belgium offer english taught programs because that that might be on your mind because you know belgium speaks french and i think they speak dutch or german so yeah some belgian universities offer certain courses in english so at the university of uh, namur where french is the primary medium several bachelor's and master's subjects are taught in english the same goes for University St. Louis, which offers English classes in the faculties of philosophy, economics, and law. Okay, that being said, let's look at the affordable universities in Belgium for international students. I'm going to be talking about seven of them as per this article. The first on my list is University Libre de Bruxelles. Okay, and the tuition fee range from, I mean, the tuition fee ranges from 835 euros per year for undergraduate courses and it ranges from 835 euros per year for graduate that is master's courses okay so basically these are just ranges and it, it depends on the programs so more specifically if you want to know exactly what it is the recent tuition is better to check the link in the description under this video Okay, where you just need to click on the link and it's going to take you to the official website and you're going to find updated information. The next on my list is University St. Louis, Bruxelles. This one, the tuition fee range is around 835 euro per year for undergraduate courses and 835 euros per year for graduate courses, which is the master's courses. It has campuses in St. Louis and uh, Marie Harps. Is divided into the faculties of philosophy, law, economics, translation, interpretation, European studies. Okay, all in all, in all, this department oversees twenty-five bachelor degree programs and two master degree programs. So basically, you just need to go to the link under this video so that you find out more. Now, the next on my list is University de Liège, and the tuition is this. As you can see, it's less than a thousand euro, or they are less than thousand euro per year, which is incredibly cheap. And this one, you can find law, political science, medicine, applied science, veterinary medicine, agro science, bioengineering, etc. Even architecture. Then we have Gent University, and this one, the tuition fee range between 
1,092 euros per year Dutch thought programs, okay, for undergraduate, then this amount for uh, graduate programs, which is master's, and it is still cheap at this price, okay. Then uh, the next on my list is Hazel to university. The tuition fee is just around 1,000 euros per year for graduate programs, okay. Then the next on my list is University of Antwerp, okay, and the tuition is around 3,100 euros per year, okay. Then the next on my list, which is the last but not the least, the UC Leuven Limburg University. The tuition fee ranges between or ranges from 5,800 euros per year. Okay. And, you know, the UC Leuven Limburg is one of the Belgium's youngest universities. Okay. And it is considered a Catholic applied science school. It is founded in 2014. All right, so that being said, these are the seven cheapest universities that I found on this site today. I would like you to know about these things. You know, a lot of people do not, do not know that schools in Belgium are cheap. Even me, I, I didn't know before. I just found out about this information today and I decided to share this with you, okay? So I would like you to check out these universities and start applying. You know, uh, scholarships are very com competitive these days and... If you can get a cheap school, it will be easier for you and it will save you a whole lot of stress and time, you know, and it is better for you. It, you know, it will be the best, best thing for you because some of these scholarships that, that people get abroad would require you to go back to your country, like you have restriction on what you need to do, you know, but when you, when you pay your school fees on your own, nobody is restricting you. You don't need to go back to your country after studies. You know all these things, so that's why it's better if you can find a cheap university and go and go. All right, so guys, that will be it about this content. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do subscribe, click the notification bell so that you can notify whenever I drop content. Okay, I have lots of videos for you to watch, and you know, like these videos to support it. Okay, and if you want to talk to me one on one, the link is in the description. Just click on the link, do the needful, and send me a screenshot of that on my one of my social media handles which i would prefer you contact me on instagram or facebook okay then we can plan and have a one-on-one -on -one meeting also if you want us to do your university applications for you the link is in the description now right now we're only doing for poland but in the future we're thinking of also extending or expanding to other countries where we'll be able to um you know apply to some other countries as well Okay, the link is in the description. Ensure that you reach out to us before you uh, book for that. And also, if you want us to help you to create a professional CV for you, European Standard, the link is in the description. Follow the steps as well. Okay, all right, guys, that will be it about this content. Thank you for watching. Till I come away again, have a great time. See you in my next video.